All right, welcome back to Best Automation Tools. Today, we're going to talk about how to make a money-making group on Facebook and or on Meta, whatever you want to call it. And I'm setting up a new Facebook group for a business uh, that I am starting, another business I'm starting. And uh, this one is called Flight Attendant Spanish Lessons. And so before you start a money-making Facebook group, you have to have a money-making plan. You have to have a business plan. A Facebook group is just part of the business plan, of course. And so um, what I am doing is I happen to be both a flight attendant and I am bilingual in Spanish. I've been teaching Spanish to flight attendants in the back of the airplanes when I've been flying recently. And someone suggested that I should start a Facebook group and uh, do uh, Spanish lessons there. And it got me to thinking about it. And uh, I could certainly sell. I love selling, obviously. And um, got me thinking about how I could do this and make a business out of it. I actually don't want to do the teaching of Spanish itself, so I've partnered with a Spanish tutor who was willing to take clients if I were uh, able to get them. And of course, I know how to run Facebook ads to my new group. So what I'm going to do is create a new group called Flight Attendant Spanish Lessons. I'm going to drop a couple lessons in here every week. And then, of course, every, I don't know, three or four weeks, I'll run a promotion and I will get people on the phone or... Um, on a landing page and sell them Spanish, like a package of Spanish lessons, and then hand them on over to the Spanish tutor. And of course, I will pay her to, to teach those lessons. And um, that's what we're going to do. So I have already hit, um, when you go on Facebook, when you're ready, all you have to do on the left hand side is let's see here, if you go hit the groups tab, and then on the left hand side here, you will see create new group. If you click create new group, that's when it will say um, group name. And you can go ahead and choose your group name. So again, I did flight attendant Spanish lessons. And then you can choose a uh, privacy, of course, you want to make it a private group. And there's a reason for that. But you want it to make it visible so that people can find it. And if you want to invite friends later, we're going to do that later. So once you're ready, you can hit the create button. And once you're in the group, then what we have to do is uh, go ahead and fill out some of the group settings here. So I'm going to scroll down and do group settings, go into the name and the description. And of course, the name is already there. Now in the name of the group, I put clearly who it's for flight attendant and what it is. It's Spanish lessons. So flight attendant, Spanish lessons, very, very simple. Of course, you can get a little more creative with it, but I want it to be very, very clear what it is and who it's for. So that when this person, when a flight attendant who is interested in Spanish lessons comes across it, they're gonna be like, oh my God, this is the group. God brought me to this group. That's what I want. All right, now I have already written out a group description for the group. And uh, if you see this here, I'm gonna post it down below, you're welcome to just copy it if you want. I don't care. I'm gonna make sure the spacing is nice, but it should have a nice group description, what it's for, what it's about, who it's not for. And this is the about that when someone clicks on the group before they join, this is the description. Welcome to Flight Attendant Spanish Lessons Group. It's a group for flight attendants who want to learn Spanish for work or just for fun. Are you a flight attendant who wants to learn and practice your Spanish skills? You're in the right place. If you don't want to learn Spanish, that's okay, but this group may not be for you. We help flight attendants learn Spanish, even if the last Spanish class you had was way back in high school. Talk to other flight attendants who are also learning Spanish. Share what works for you and ask questions. The more you talk, the more you learn. Every week we have posts and live videos to help you learn Spanish as easily as possible. We'll show you what you need to know and how to start speaking as soon as possible. See it in the group, Ryan and the flight attendant project team. Okay, perfect. So we'll hit save and that will be the group. All right, new member intro, we definitely Create a message that new members will see when they visit your group for the first time. We will fill that out later, but the answer will be yes. We want that on. We want high group to be visible location. I'm going to put where I live, which is in Orlando, Florida. And let's see. We're going to change the web address to groups. We're going to do Spanish for flight attendants. That will be the URL. So that's facebook.com forward slash groups forward slash Spanish for flight attendants. Group color. I like a brown yellow color. I don't know. I just do. And group affiliation. We will go ahead and sign that up for me. 
and then manage membership who can join the group we just want profiles on this i don't want organizations i just want flight attendants who can approve member requests um only i can approve those member requests and who is pre-approved to join nobody is pre-approved everyone has to go through it and there's a reason for that get to that later do we allow anonymous posting no i don't anyone in the group can post it doesn't need post approval uh, who can create chats, blah, blah, blah. Let's see. So you just want to go through these, but those are the important ones that I can see right now. I want to link my page. Oh, I don't want to create a new page. Sorry. I'm not going to do that. I would like to link a page eventually, but it doesn't seem to allow me to do that right now. That's okay. And I will eventually want to add Zoom into here. So let's go ahead and add Zoom so that I can go live in here. So we're going to do this. And we want to go live in the group about once a week to add context. So Zoom is added. Beautiful. Next thing I want to do is go to the membership questions. And the membership questions are the three questions that are asked when someone joins the group. So I've already set up my questions. And one of them is just to make sure, again, it's to vet them to make this group is for flight attendants who are ready to learn Spanish. Which statement best describes you? And this is for me to gather information, and I'm going to collect that information and put it into my CRM. So we'll do a multiple choice, add an option. I'm a flight attendant with some Spanish experience. Well, some, let's see, but I'm a flight attendant, um, and I, let's see, what could be the three options? I'm totally new to Spanish. We could do that. I'm a flight attendant with some Spanish, but want to know more. You could say, I'm a flight attendant, and I am looking for one-on-one -on -one Spanish lessons. No, you can say, I'm a flight attendant, and I want to become as bilingual, as fluent in Spanish as possible. Something like that. Good. The second question is about getting their email address. So we will create a next question and that will be a written answer and that one says but what's your best email address to receive special invitations to attend our live weekly training classes your email address will be used to send up promotional material we think you will love and then the third says we specialize helping flight attendants get to conversational spanish in three to six months would you like us to send you a pm explaining how type now or later below and again, we want them to type an answer here. People tend to type a little bit more. So perfect. Now, these three questions, again, will be um, given to the prospect when they uh, apply to join the group. And this just gives me more information. But I have a secret way, which I will share in another video or maybe even down below, about how to collect this information and port it over to your CRM. In my case, go high level automatically. Okay. And uh, I will have another video on how to do that and a link down to that. It's called Group Kit. You can get it down below. It's a simple plugin and um, it's amazing. It's like one of the best things. Uh, and it's definitely required if you're going to have a money making group. Okay, well, let's go back here. These are all set and I think we are good to go. The only thing remaining for the setup then would be a new banner up top. Facebook has some. Of course, you can just go to Canva and we can create one there, a new banner. Let's log in even for free, hit create a design. And the Facebook group cover size in 2024 right now anyway is 1640 by 856. So we will go custom size, 1640, 856 pixels, create a new design, easy. And then we will go to elements and look for, I don't know, travel, maybe a nice photo. I also typed in conversation to see if that what that pops up How about this one. This is pretty cool. Oh, it seems to be a professional one. I can't use that one right now. Go here and we just want the free ones for now. All right. So this is where I'm going to uh, leave off for just today. It's just it's good enough. It's super simple. I was able to create it totally free. So I'm going to go ahead and download it as a PNG. Perfect. It should be there now. And I'm going to go ahead and upload it here. Let's see. Upload a photo from my downloads. And I hate when that happens. It looks like the uh, internet gave me the wrong proportions for this. I hate that. Okay, now I just, uh, I didn't actually find the correct size. I just moved everything down to make it fit. And that seems to work. So I'm going to hit save changes. And there you have it. Um, I think we're pretty much 
good to go. Add a cover letter, add a description. We did that. And we just have to create a post. And uh, that'll be in another video. Anyway, this is just how you set up a money-making Facebook group with some of those hints and tricks in there. Again, you just want to make sure you have a good description, a good relevant name. Uh, you want to have some membership questions and the appropriate settings set up for you so that when people come in, you collect their information and their data. Uh, another video will become forthcoming shortly. Hope you have a great day, guys. Bye. Oh, also, if you find this helpful, please uh, hit subscribe at the bottom and uh, leave a comment. Thanks.